Okay, what diameter telescope? So they're separated by 1.8 times 10 to the 11th meters, right? So this is like, you know, solar system length there. I think what, what, one astronomical unit is like 1.5 times 10 to the 11th, right? Okay, but they are 3 times 10 to the 17th meters from us. So here's star A and star B, and this distance here is uh, 1.8 times 10 to the 11th, right? And we are here. Okay, and so... So the question is, what's that angle there, right? Okay, and this distance is 3 times 10 to the 17th meters, a million times, more than a million, two million times roughly this distance, right? Okay, so concept zero is that that angle is going to be this distance divided by that, right? So it's going to be uh, S divided by R. So it's 1.8 times 10 to the 11th meters divided by 3 times 10 to the 17th meters. Okay, so 1.8 E11 divided by 3 E17. And I get 6 times 10 to the minus 7th radians. All right, so that is the angle. So now let's do our little, our little, um, oh, this is 32 light years. There we go. Okay, so, uh, so this is just sort of like a neighborhood star, right? Okay. Uh, that was just a random interjection. Okay, so now we're going to use the, the Raleigh formula, right? Uh, 1.22 times the wavelength, right, uh, divided by the aperture. So we want to solve for B. So B is going to be 1.22 lambda over theta, right? So that's going to be 1.22 times 550. E minus 9, right, divided by, and then this thing, 6 times 10 to the minus 7th uh, radians, right, that's meters. So let's figure it out, 1.22 times 550 E minus 9, divided by the answer I just got. One point, I get 1.1183 meters, right, so 1.1 meter telescope. 1.1 times 3.281, No, I think it's 281. That's 3.6. It's almost a four-foot telescope, yeah? Yay.